Hi, and welcome back to the Watchman on the Wall channel. This prophetic encouragement comes from Sylvia Noosh, Round Rock, Texas. A time to birth, battle, and build. I hear the Lord saying, You are in a time to birth, to battle, and build, but it's not the time to be unaware. For though much opposition has come against my people, you are equipped to battle. The threats that have come against you are smoke and mirrors. You will refute every lie that exalts itself against my knowledge. Keep your shields, warrior. Keep them up and refuse to allow the lies to penetrate your heart and your mind. Your enemy's intent is to defer hope from your life, bringing despair and distraction. But know that I have you surrounded. I'm singing songs of deliverance. Your weapons are not of this world, and my battle plans will confound the enemy. Refuse to allow your gaze to move from the tasks at hand. Do not listen to the taunting voices that would seek to divert your time and attention. It is time to fear not. I have made provision for every obstacle that you encounter. Do not let the enemy's idle threats hinder the work, for it is your time to build. As in the time of Nehemiah, build with one hand and hold your weapon with the other. My word must dwell in you richly. Honor my word and the wisdom that is now yours. Listen for the sound of my voice and honor those who herald the trumpet sound. When you hear my sound, run towards it, for there you will find breakthrough and grace. My war room strategies are there. I am restoring your fortunes and bringing you out of captivity. No longer will your dreams be cast aside nor forgotten. I am loosing the ties that have bound you. You will find your restrictions falling away in the light of my favor. You have cried many tears in your years of sowing, but you will soon return with songs of joy and fruits of abundant harvest. I planted my seeds of vision within you, nurturing and tending them so that when the time of birthing has fully come, you'll be ready. Now is that time of building, of birthing, of fruit bearing. Now is the time of exploding and exponential harvest. Do not doubt what I have sown in you in the secret place. Do not doubt the dreams and visions that you have awakened to at the night. You are not bringing to the table just any dream, but dreams birthed out of seeds that I, your father, have intentionally sown for this time, for this season. It is time to advance, to move forward and advance with me, and I will reveal my plans as you carry the vision. Just as Gideon placed the trumpets and empty jars with torches in the hands of his warriors, they went out against the Midians, and in the same way, I will place my unique and secret war strategies in your hands. For your building season, I will bring confusion in the enemy's camp as you move forward, carrying my God seeds within you. Yes, I will cause your enemies to flee as your faith-filled battle cry comes, not by might nor by power, but by my spirit, says the Lord Almighty. By my spirit, you will see the birthing of the God seeds you've carried. By my spirit, you will build according to the blueprints of heaven's design. By my spirit, you will defeat the enemies. That rise up against you. It is time to birth, to battle, and to build. Advance forward courageously. Watch for my delivering hand and favor to build, to birth in this time of exponential increase for my kingdom. Friends, see Psalm 126, verses 1 through 6, in your time with the Lord. Heavenly Father, we unite our hearts, my friend and I, we unite our hearts together with our sister Sylvia. We are here to declare this time of birthing, of battling, and of building. Lord, I think so often, at least I do, maybe not you, but friend, I I tend to think about it in terms of a linear process. First one, then the next, then the next. But like our sister Sylvia is saying, the Holy Spirit through her is saying, I think we need to be a little more like Nehemiah. We need to do it together. One hand building, one hand fighting. One hand declaring the, the seeds one hand, believing the promises. The other hand, doing the work that God has set ahead of us. Lord, I thank you. The battle's not ours, it's yours indeed. Thank you that we still play a part. Lord, I pray that we step into all the provision you have for us. Lord, I pray that we step into the fearlessness that is this time of exploding, exponential harvest. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.